morning. This is Anonymous Watchman here. You'll get my full name, as is on my FB uh, profile here shortly as I talk to these senators. The purpose of this recorded call, which I'm making, is I am calling three of the Florida senators over Pasco and Hillsborough County, Florida. The reason I'm calling these senators is because CPS, a.k.a. Eckerd, Child Protective Services um, is taking children into their care or kidnapping them I should say lawfully kidnapping them and they are immediately changing their their um, benefits such as if they get um, Social Security disability and then when these children get put into foster care this this money gets put into an account but the foster parents never get it the kids never get it and that's, that's considered social security fraud. Now, I'm going to record these calls to these senators to find out why they're allowing a, a Florida state contractor known as Eckert to commit social security fraud against children. So let's get started with the first number. The first senator that I will be calling is Senator Jack Latvala. District 16, Pasco County, Florida. And let me get the number here. It's 941-741-1111. Uh, and now let's show that it's calling that number. All right. Put it on speaker. Yes, ma'am. I am uh, a concerned we the people. I am also a member of the press and I'm recording this conversation. Okay. I am calling to inquire why a Florida state contractor of Eckert, also known as CPS, is lawfully kidnapping children, changing their Social Security disability benefits to a trust account, but those children never receive these funds. And nor do foster parents that these children go into care under. And, and well, the supervisor that I've talked to with Eckert says that, yes, um, they are the payee, but caseworkers over individual children are stating that, oh, they don't get funds, and if they did, we'd have an account for them. You know, and I've talked to foster parents that are saying, well, we've never got any of these funds. That's Social Security fraud, ma'am. That is Social Security fraud. Eckert, Eckert Services, which is also known as uh, Child Protective Services of Florida. And where are they located? What county? They're located in every county you have a Child Protective Services office. Okay, and well, well the, the office I'm calling about is, is located in Pasco County. Because okay. it's pertaining to a personal case that, that I happen to be uh, um, paying attention to very closely. So there's a case in Pasco County? Yes. And um, the whole thing here is that, uh, well, we've recently got uh, uh, the case that I'm inquiring about mainly. The child's been returned to the mother's care, and it's been almost, uh, she, she's been home over 30 days, and they still have refused to change back to Social Security back to where the child can even get it. Okay. Social Security says that, that the state of Florida has the, uh, is, is listed beneficiary, after uh, the mother took the, so the the Social Security office, the judge's order stating that the daughter's back in her care, Social Security said, "Well, the payee, being Eckert, needs to needs to make the changes." But okay. right, go ahead. so um, I'm trying to figure out how how Eckert is allowed to commit Social Security fraud, and nothing can be done about it. County where I am is locally done through the sheriff's office. Um, well, I, 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 if you want to go that far back to the sheriff's office in this case, I can tell you this: the whole case is fraudulent because I have the body cam footage from Officer B. Nixon of the Hillsborough of the Pasco County Sheriff's Office 
all the all of the body cam footage which does not comply with any of his written reports that were turned in as his, as his reports for the case. Okay, well, then before you go any further, there's two other things here. We're talking about Social Security, which is not a, a state program, however... But if I'm informing you that, that a felony fraud act is being committed and you do not take action, then you become just as guilty, ma'am. You become just as guilty as those committing the fraud. Okay, if you allow me to finish, okay? Oftentimes with Medicaid and Social Security, they can be both done on a state level. Well, okay, <laughs> this is a child that is in a state program or who, who is now out of the state program. Uh, but resides in Pasco County. So no, the, the child now resides in Hillsborough County, but the case was started, and all the, all the court cases and all the court dates are in Pasco County. Okay, what is the child's name? Melody Leith. I'm sorry? Melody Leith. Melody Leith, L-E-E. L-E-I-T-H. Is that her last name, is Leith? Leith, yes. L-E-I-T-H. Okay. What is her social security number? I can't give you that. That's a felony for me to even give you her social security number. No, it's uh, not. Yes, it is. Over recorded line, and over any line, it is a okay, felony well, to give out a social security I'm number. Able to, to I, could, I could give you the last four. I could give you the last four, ma'am, but it is a well, felony fine. to give out your... No, not necessary. What is your relationship to this child? Ma'am, I am a concerned we the people, a reporter of the Universal Life Press, and an also proud member of the Anonymous Family. I have to, a parent would have to contact me in order for me the to make an right inquiry. Here. The parent is right here, ma'am. The parent is right here. I'm the one okay, that's... Okay, then let me speak with the parent. There you go. I mean, he's also listed in this court case, but... Okay, so he doesn't want to give me any information. No, I'm, I'm protecting you. My name is Emily McManaway. M C M A N A W A Y. M A N A W A Y. And what is your uh, when did you get that your daughter back? On the third of May. Okay. And um, what is the phone number I can reach you at? My phone number is eight one three eight three eight seven two eight zero. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Uh, first of all, I'm going to make an inquiry um, on, 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 on this for you. Pasco County is not our county, so uh, you may wind up hearing back from somebody else. Okay. Yeah. Because it... Hillsboro and Manatee County. We don't oh. have a Pasco County. Okay, because when we went on... When we went on the website to pull names, it does say District 16, Pasco District Office. And we have two other senators call one of the other phone. That's the office that you're involved with, with your child? Well, we pulled up a few because there's a few of them. And so we're calling all three of them. So we're, yeah. Have you spoken to your representative or your senator? Where, um, where, where we're working, yeah, call. you you were the first phone call. Okay, don't make another phone call because it's, it's, <laughs> it, 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 you're going to call three different offices and you're going to have three different people making an inquiry um, on your behalf. And so you're, you're, you're having, it's just saying you're using resources that one office can make. I can make the inquiry on your behalf. Oh, I appreciate that because, like I said, I've tried dealing with my case manager who denies that they've ever gotten the funds but yet i've called social security couldn't get it switched over myself so went down to social security office and was told that a court order does not verify that the child is in my home and that eckerd dash state of florida are the only people that can switch the payee but it's beyond me how for 18 months which is how long my daughter was in state custody for they deny that they've ever gotten the funds. Okay, so she was in state custody for 18 months. Yes, ma'am. She's now in your custody. Yes, ma'am. And we want to get the Social Security switched over so you start receiving those payments. Okay, let me um, make a phone call. And I'm asking you to please not call another office because it's, it's just you're, you're, at, you're calling three different offices we're all going to do the same thing. Okay. So please, please 
Okay, thank you very much. This call will be published live. Okay, this call will be, thank will you. be published live to a 35 plus thousand members of a news group, just so you're aware. We are demanding action. Okay, sir, I'm, I'm trying to help you. I said yes. you don't reside in our county. However, I'm going to take the steps to make an inquiry on your behalf. Thank I you. I understand that. Thank you. Have a good day. Okay, thank you very much because we've oh, managed welcome. to get nowhere on our own. <laughs> thank okay, you. Well, you know, I, I, I said I would do it, and then you keep saying your thing. So, you know, let me see if I can't do something. Then you can get okay. a or okay? Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Bye-bye. Yeah. Well, I'm sorry. Okay.